Oh, Zach Furnace, aka Jesus. Zach Furnace. Jesus Thor. Jesus Christ. Hey, Jesus oh, what did I call Thor. him? I gave him a name. It was Jesus. It was Jesus Bonanza. That was his new name. His, <sighs> his name. No, I'm gonna call him Jesus Bonanza. There we go. That is Zach Furnace's new name. Zach Furnace is awesome. He there is I a see. great writer and a great friend. And I'm glad he's watching this. Yes, this is me. When is when is Jesus ever not a good friend? He's <laughs> See, Jesus this is, this is, Bonanza. This is the part where I can offend everyone on the stream and be kicked off by CJ and never be allowed on the stream again. What? So I'm just gonna say nothing. Well, go ahead. <laughs> I have heard some horrible things. Did you not meet me at 18 when I was like, I love 4chan. <laughs> oh, it's a good thing you I'm never... CJ. I, I have a internet. hotel with 4chan people with afros. <laughs> what happens? I'm so confused. I added, I added you on Skype, Zach. It's I cutting out a lot. That's not good. I wonder if it's a stream or if it's just you. Let me listen for a bit. Oh no. Hmm. CJ, you should do your thing. I'm, I'm doing my thing. I'm just doing Stop the, the cutting tweets. cutting out for me. That's weird. I'm doing the, the promotion of the, of, of the stream. To the Facebooks and the Twitters and the and the stuff. We should have to. We should you know, CJ. You've been talking about who to bring on podcasts and what special guests to get. I think we should actually try and get Fred Durst. Shut, <laughs> shut up. <laughs> Why not? Just shut up. We, he's pretty scary. Who's he's, he's like a forty-year-old that dresses like an eighteen-year-old from nineteen ninety-nine. So is Tony Hawk. <laughs> yep. Yeah, that that's actually that is definitely Tony Hawk. I don't want Fred Durst on the. I don't want Fred Durst Dursting all over this shit. I love to, to listen to Tony Hawk when he does PR for the Tony Hawk games, because he sucks at it. He is so bad at selling video games, but he always yeah. wants to do it because he's because really Tony passionate Hawk and he doesn't even really care about it. So like you, you can you can see he genuinely cares and enjoys video game and wants to tell you like, hey, this game is really fun. Closer to my house. But he has no idea what the fuck he's talking about. I actually really love Tony Hawk 3. Uh, in my life? Yeah. Like most of the Tony Hawk games, actually. I oh. hated the, like, Ooh. Project 8 and, um... American I Wasteland. I, no, I love the American Tony Wasteland. Hawk Ride. Oh, yeah, that sucked. Yeah, the, the motion control stuff were terrible. Ooh. Uh, but... From the actual, like, regular Ow. style ones. I didn't like Project hey, look, 8. look, I found a VHS. After Project 8, wasn't this game either. is in the 90s. Look, there's a VHS tape right there. This game <laughs> is Tony Hawk. Oh, wait, yeah. Must heal. You just... You, 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 maybe you are actually Tony Hawk. Yes, I am the Chinese assassin Tony Hawk. <laughs> I'm Tony Jiao. Tony Jia. I thought it was J Japanese. No, the... the Lo Wang is Chinese. He's just in mm -hmm. Japan, for some reason. Being... So are you Chinese or Japanese? I don't think the original I... developers knew the difference, so they just had to wing did. it when oh, they did the... the um, okay, we mentioned this a lot on the last game. The original game is completely racist. Yeah, exactly. It's really fucking racist. This one is, this one is actually genuinely funny. <laughs> I like that one. It's horrible with his jokes. Red barrels. Shoot the red barrels. I know. I'm just trying to get more than one next to it. I'll do what it for game him. did I play recently? Oh, sleep. Was it that I played recently? Uh, Killzone Mercenary on the Vita. Really good, really good shooter. There was only one part I didn't like, and it was mostly just because it used like they were like red barrels everywhere. And I'm like, huh? And it was a turret shooting. It's like, I wonder what I'm supposed to do here. What do you have against the elf left in the account? <laughs> oh, I see. What you're Fuck you, demon! Quick. Um, worst case, like, uh, worst example of the red barrels in the game, and yo, good, it's a, it's a real live horror scheme. Actually, the hate of Far Cry Blood Dragon again. What's the opening scene from Far Cry Blood Dragon when you're also in one of those, when, you, when you're in the Zach shop, Furtis, and you're also send your disciples our way. on a on-rail section, and it's just barrels everywhere for you to blow up. Why is Zach Furness not sending his 12 disciples? We need those 12 disciples to bring this up to 18 viewers, so do it. Zach, you should go as uh, Eddard Stark for Halloween. I think you'd do it. Have you guys seen when? Um, have you guys seen uh, when he cosplayed Thor, like at the Avengers uh, and Marvel Universe? Yeah, yeah. Thor. I yeah, did. I did. Really well. Stupid image. It's like I the best the, image. I thought the Nathan Drake one. Did you see the Nathan Drake one? I didn't see the Nathan Drake one. I like Actually, that. Actually, 
Yeah. I've got a fucking like, I can't think of what I'm going to do. May the power of Christ compel you! I remember when I was younger, I thought Exorcist was hilarious. Now I actually think it's a scary movie. It's one of the few yeah. movies that I actually think it's scary. because you were possessed at that time. It's a bit no, of a... I remember, I, I would see, like, I would see, like, the part where she's like, What, Jesus, yeah. fuck you! She's masturbating with a crucifix, and I would, like, start laughing. <laughs> now it's like, wow, this is fucked up. <laughs> So I'm pretty sure you didn't know what masturbating was at that point. Maybe you did. Maybe that's why it was funny to you. I just thought it was funny because she'd be like, Do you know what she did? Your hunting daughter? <laughs> <laughs> Your mother is in here, Father Martin. That's such a good movie. Have you ever seen the third one? Yeah, yeah. yeah. He's, he's, he's about to say, yeah. The what? <laughs> the one is, I, I like the third one better than the first one, even. I think the third one is really good. Yeah, I know. Um, the, uh, the third one has that one scene. I won't spoil it. You should all. The everyone best, best jump scare ever. Yeah, you know what it is. Yeah. Like hallway, hallway. Oh yes. That made that was so bad. Oh, it's just like oh my god. Amazing. Um, I, I feel a bit sad for Exodus 2 because it, it the biggest problem with Exodus 2 was that the studio wanted it to be Exodus 2. And yeah, the director and didn't. Did He's you guys like, see those oh, two remakes? I mean, the two prequels. They were both. Oh, the, they, they were both like the same plot, so except it was really yeah. different. Yeah, yeah there was they a made, prequel. Yeah, they made two prequels. It was really yeah. weird remember, because it's like the it's like two directors the got the same script and just changed and did different things with yeah. it. Yeah, they, they released them like either either the same year or one year apart from each other, and they had two very different names. They're both prequels, like except and they're both terrible. Yeah, one was called. <laughs> the beginning though, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah. and then that the was other, one. I think yeah. the other one didn't have the name Exorcist in it. I didn't even see that one. I remember that one was hilarious because when the woman actually gets possessed by uh, the devil. Hey, hold on, hold on, chef talk here. Uh, Sack, yes, this is being recorded and it will be archived. Um, uh, the previous uh, stream we did, which we played up to the point where we are right now, is currently on Reliant Horror's YouTube channel yep. in seven parts. You can listen to me and CJ complain and talk about stuff that aren't Shadow Warrior while playing Shadow Warrior. Or you can just <laughs> watch the hour and 50 minute uh, version on Twitch. It's all it's right there in our profile. Yeah, it's there as well. I want to remake The Exorcist, except for you get possessed by Fred Durst. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> what is she, she going to like masturbate with instead of a fucking hot dog? Not a crucifix? <laughs> Chocolate starfish. Like a, like, no, not, not like just the hot dog meat, but the bun as well. So just the whole cartoonish, like a rub, like a rubber dog toy hot dog. <laughs> fuck me, fuck me. Tweet, tweet. Um, I was gonna say like, um, I, 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 I always like when like uh, sequels to famous horror movies end up being better than the original ones. I think Exodus Three is is better than the original Exodus, even though they're both great movies. And also, and this I is really this like is kind of Red Dwarf in that movie. Yeah, I. This, is, so this is this is not really a popular. Oh yeah, Bredorf is amazing in that movie. Uh, this is not really a popular opinion, but I actually think Psycho 2 is better than Psycho. I haven't seen either. Hi, Zach. You haven't seen Old Boy either, you bastard. Hi, Zach. Yeah, Bye. I've seen I've seen all the Psycho films, um, including the pointless remake. Um, uh, but Psycho 2 is what? really good. Dude, this is so weird. What? The author of Silver Linings Playbook is following me on Twitter and just liked my tweet about Shadow Warrior. What the fuck? What yeah, the yeah. yeah. Mean, what the fuck? That's so crazy. Dan Wait, hold Huffman? on. Are you watching? Is he watching? That's so weird. Dan Huffman, are you watching? Yeah, he might be. This is good. That are you is some, sure? He just, he just favorited it. Somebody tweet that. Silver Linings Playbook <laughs> author is watching my stupid Shadow Warrior stream because that is priceless and amazing. And what you're doing is walking into walls. What's left? I know. <laughs> so you do it. You do it. Some, one of you do it and I'll retweet it because it's much faster. I'll do it. I'll do it. And I'll retweet it from the Rely channel. That is, that is freaking priceless. That is the that is lifetime achievement. Can can I be Bradley Cooper in your next movie? In your next novel movie? I can be the Bradley Cooper you've always been looking for. Oh, oh we we dropped the viewer. <laughs> oh no. Hold on, this, is, this is the official sequel to Silver Linings Playbook. <laughs> Not Shadow Warrior, you have to just talk about Shadow Warrior. <laughs> <laughs> we're not even talking about Shadow Warrior. <laughs> no, we're talking about Exorcist from Psycho. So what, did, Psycho too. what did I do um, that he's following me? This is bad. Dan, oh, Dan, Dan, Dan Huffman, you actually, are you watching and you like Shadow Warrior? You like me? My god. Can I be Bradley Cooper now? Oh, 
I, I just, I really need to tweet this, or, or Kyle, make sure you tweet me, you add me in that tweet so I could, uh, you know, retweet it. Man, I, I, this is the, this is the negative part of doing this online, because that means I, I mean, otherwise CG, you could just go tweet all you want and we could just take over playing. Well, we're, uh. we're on the PS4, oh look, the bunnies are just having the sex and now I broke up the sex. Yep, and... I'm going back to Psycho 2. This is scene in Psycho 2, which is like one of the scenes that I, I, can't, I very, very rarely do are the scenes where I have a hard time watching them. And it's such a weird uh, thing in comparison to other film scenes where Norman Bates is he's holding up his hands towards this, this crazy lady who's been in a bit with him in, in the psychiatric war mm. in the second movie. Oh, spoilers for Psycho 2, by the way. Uh, and, and uh, she starts going at him, going at him with a knife. So he puts his hands up to protect himself, and she just starts stabbing through his hands. Oh. And, it's, and it's not done like in any close up or any, any focus. It's just done as, she, as he's backing away, trying to get away, and you just see it slide through the hands. Really, really well done. Wait, which one is it that um, he's like perfectly reformed and everything, but then they keep tricking him into thinking that he's having slip ups and killing people, and he has like a, a girl uh, thing in his house. I I think that's three, yeah. Okay, I um, like that one. Yeah, and three is okay. Four had a good idea, but wasn't very good. Oh, he's uh, reminiscing and talking to the radio station. Gone. Yeah, it's com and, and it doesn't at all. Um, okay, guys. It doesn't guys. at all add up to the f second and third movie. And that's because the, it's meant to be a sequel to the first one again. Okay, guys, check the stream. As, as it's like a There's a foursome here, and I'm gonna about? summon. I'm Can gonna this? summon the bunny demon. Can you ask what are you talking about? We're talking about Psycho. The movie series, and why I think Psycho 2 is better than Psycho 1. Here. We're playing Shadow Warrior. Shadow Warrior is quite super. Super. Whenever he, whenever he does that thing with his hands, it reminds me of the plasmid in the original Bioshock that gave you like fire powers. Yeah. It reminds me of uh, he the healing spell in, <clears throat> um, in the Elder Scrolls games. Yeah, yeah, that too. Yeah. I have this a cool game. It actually looks kind of cool. I wasn't. I like it. Yeah, it's fun. Yeah. It's getting really good reviews. Uh, hopefully our review will go up uh, by the end of the weekend so we could be like, hey, check out our review. And then Limbisco will be lock rocking the set. Oh yeah, <laughs> I have my bat cave. I have my wang There's cave. In the early 2000s, Limbisco, what they would do is like show up places and say they were rocking the set, and that's literally all they would do. All right, so, while, while uh, I stand here, I'm Bill gonna... Murray. Wait. Bill Murray just shows up at random parties he's not invited to, that uh, just people have. In New York and stuff, and he just goes there. And like, hey, hi, I'm Bill Murray. I want to part with you guys, and just nothing else. <laughs> Hold, I got mm. this right now. I'm watching. I don't know. I was just, I was going to do the tweet thing, but I don't know if Dan Huffman's actually watching, or just he's a, he's a follower. Probably. I don't think this. You know I'm not sure this is the. I don't think you should be standing around Michael. doing anything. I don't think this is the yeah play CJ. Stop I'm playing around. Astonishing yeah, Warshaw Fantasy. Shogun of Love versus the Power of Adam. <laughs> it was a j Jello. If you're watching, it was a joke. I like making jokes about Limp Bizkit because I find them too. hilarious. These weren't here in the preview version. These were missing. What's this? First Blood, Rise of the Machines, Hard Reset. Ah. Hard Reset, Dying City. Leave me alone, demons. Look at comics. Planet Rouge. <laughs> Les événements oh de jeunes zombies. This John Lack is here. John Lack is one of my oldest internet friends. Old internet friends? Hello, one of John. My oldest. I don't know. He, he's watching, but I don't know if he's still watching. Yes, this oh. is the remake of Shadow Warrior. It's not the original. It's oh. a lot less racist from what Toby said. There is an original Shadow Warrior level. I haven't found it yet, though. Yeah, um, if you're interested in the original Shadow Warrior, I mentioned before, it's actually free on Steam. They've already just set up the entire game for free, so you can just search Shadow Warrior, there will be three games. This one, the improved version of the old one, and the original old one, and the original old one is completely free. It's yeah. crazy that they... So you can get all the racist fun you want. Look at all the bits here. Guys, you like all the bits that just lying on the floor? I remember I when like people said San Andreas was really racist because... Look, the organ pulsing. Because the the protagonist couldn't uh, swim <laughs> so bad. No, 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 no